but they show it has been in a drought of lack of rain for decades, and they show the rain coming, and a light rain over Death Valley turned it into a majestic blossoming. It transformed the whole region. One rain. And it's like you have to define and then redefine, clarify and define, because there's been so much to it. But I, in my class, in my class, I had a neat opportunity. I had the students shut their eyes. When Jesus ascended the first time, he gave gifts to the church. It's almost like we've, we've deviated from the design, God's original design. Prophets, apostles, prophets, teachers, pastors, and evangelists. Gifts to the church to equip the church, right? Nine things that are, are developed and we can study that out, but how beautiful, right? But that people's hearts would be open. Like the, the fivefold is almost as fresh today as, it, as it's ever been. It's like people need to open their hearts to don't resist the Holy Spirit. Because God's breathing on it again in a fresh, powerful way. Because he's never abandoned it. That was the heartbeat. He's never said, oh, you know, the, it's, oh. It's, this is the plan. This is my, my desire. Yeah. And, and Quebec, here. we're learning. We're such a right. learning place. You awesome. know, it's like, like sometimes I think I, I told Jonathan, we're maybe 10 years or 15 years or maybe even 20 years behind, you know. So we're, we're still learning maybe stuff that you know for 10 years ago, you know, and that you guys are living or in it, but we're still in the premise of all that, you know. Right. Like the fivefold, we believe in it, but we, we don't have anything to grasp. We don't have right. church that Nurse Ali could be our example of how right, they got it, you know, we can learn from them, you know. So that's why we're blessed to connect with Jonathan or people like that. Because we're introducing new stuff, you know, yeah. new mindset. We don't think revival in Quebec will come from Jonathan, you know, it will come from really from our land, you know. Yeah. But we're in the equipping season, you know. Yeah. We're still in the learning season. We just see the little, you know, uh, I don't know, what was it? Sprout. Yeah. Sprout. Last yeah. Sprout yeah. Is starting yeah. Last. That's it. We're just seeing the sprout coming out. Jonathan, I showed a clip on Ooh. Sunday. Mm. Anybody into that Planet Earth? You know, have you seen the Planet Earth series? Oh, I know what you're talking about. It's incredible. I know like, what you're talking about. It's, in, it's incredible, right? There's a one minute and nine second clip that shows, number one, I thought, the deserts. And, you know, they go over the whole planet. A third of the Earth is in de is deserts. A third of Planet Earth is deserts. One third. And they show Death Valley. Death Valley is the hottest place on the planet. And they show this time-lapse photography is absolutely, it, it, it's breathtaking and it bring tears to your eyes. But they show it, it has been in a drought of lack of rain for decades. And they show the rain coming and a light rain over Death Valley turned it into a majestic blossoming. It transformed the whole region. One rain. Oh, just one rain. But there were there were seeds in the ground that were 30 years. Wow. They were waiting, yeah. dormant, waiting for the rain. And it's just, it's so portrayed like in the natural, yeah, right? What God yeah, could do, yeah, like yeah. seeds that have been yeah. sown. Yeah. Wow. 30 years and God just came and breathed on it and rained and it flourished. And in that flourishing, when they did that filming, 
They hadn't seen that type of vegetation and flowering in 100 years. So Jonathan, I showed that on Sunday. I'm telling you, people were, had tears in their eyes because it, it was just. And so you take that and you say, there are dreams in people's hearts right? that are dormant, just seeds, people, just, people. just people. Me and you, hearing your story, right? <laughs> just contending, believing. Right? Anyway, it was powerful. But that that clip just moved me, and I was just lots of friends. I had I love the planet or series. I bought my kids knew I loved this one, but they bought me the whole DVD set. So I had to be re revisiting. And that scene came out, and I said, oh my goodness, it was awesome. It's a great that picture. Yeah, it's a great picture. So, and there's a lamb to be saved here in Quebec, you know, there's yes. a lamb, there's people uh, searching, you know, we're searching everywhere. Quebec is, is really lost in this sense. You know? But at the same time, it's the best place for God to show up. It's awesome. Know? Somebody said, if God can show up in Quebec, can show up everywhere, you know, meaning like it's not an easy place, but if revival comes here, revival will go up all around the world. You know, really. So, yeah. even neighboring, work in the field. Well, at the same time, it's like when we started to pray for revival 10, 12 years ago, there was nothing going on in Quebec. Like, nothing, you know. Kingdom can trans has the power to transform any yeah. region, mm -hmm. and if it's not transformed, it's just not transformed yet. Not but yet. Not and that's yet. why you're working the soil yeah. and you're planting, and the seeds can be in the ground 30 yeah. years. Yeah. And the rain will come and it'll flourish. That's what I said. I said, um, like at the GU, I said, I'm I'm planning for 50 years. You know, it's like maybe I won't see even what I'm we're doing right now. With the result of because I feel we're we're starting a reformation in yes, Quebec, yes. but with the start of yeah. it, you know, Luther did not see all the scope. Oh, absolutely! Of, of, of what he's done, you know, yeah. he was actually just sitting in front of him, fighting for his opinion. That's what only what he did. You know? I love that. I love that. But we were talking about it. Funny little things going. I love being with John because he inspires me because he's actually doing things now that his biggest concern is that it'll be remembered a hundred years from now. Yeah. Not even five years from now, a hundred years from now. Mm -hmm. They're gonna say we had a reformation, I was part of yeah. a reformation. Yeah. Shifted everything, right? It's a, it's, he's thinking a hundred years from now. I know. Not five that's, years from uh, now. That's, well, the, the, the rapturous mindset change your thinking. Oh, absolutely. You know, maybe we're wrong. Maybe we could be wrong. Let's say we're wrong. Sure. Maybe it's wrong. Maybe Let's we're wrong. We're maybe wrong. wrong. Let's we'll say live we're our wrong. whole life and we'll find out. We'll find out <laughs> anyway. So that's why I don't <laughs> fight about it. But the mindset is different. Though. Yes. Yeah. You need that new fresh mindset that yes. you're fighting for legacy yes. instead of fighting for survival. Shrinking and yes. survival. And Thinking generationally, That's impacting it. the nation, not checking out. So it I affects don't, everything. I don't even think God will show up while I'm living. The way the way I think Quebec needs so much God. You know, I I, I wish he's, he's not coming in 15 years in a sense because there's so much to do right, in yeah. the province, you know, and right. yeah. and I love creating content for you guys. The biggest thing that you could do as a favor back for me is to share this like crazy. If you want to keep up on it day by day, I would highly recommend that you download the phone app. And if you already have the phone app, tell somebody else to download the phone app and share this on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, whatever, however you want to share it. Help me out, get it out there. Thanks so much.